divide 304 by 5. While doing this division, many do this mistake. What is the mistake that they do? I will let you know. But before that, we should frame it in this way. 304 and 5 here. This is your step 1. Next. Here we have 3 and here 5. 3 is smaller than 5. So we should take two numbers 30. When do we get 30 in 5 table? 5, 6, 30. Now you should subtract. 30 minus 30, 0. After this, bring down the beside number. So 4 down. After this step, the mistake happens. And the mistake is this. Here we have 4. And here 5. 4 is smaller than 5. So what many do is, they directly put dot and take 0. Which is wrong. Why is it wrong? Because just now you brought this number down. And in the same step, you want to put dot and take 0. Which is wrong. I repeat, bringing the number down and also put dot and take 0. Bring number down and put dot and take 0. Both at the same step. You are not supposed to do. Instead, what you should think of doing is, what number should we write here? If I take 1 here, I will get 5. But 5 is larger than 4. So what we should do is, we should take 0. So 5 into 0, 0. Now you should subtract. 4 minus 0, 4. Over here, we did not bring any number down. And 4 is smaller than 5. So now you can put dot and take 0. So 40. When do we get 40 in 5 table? 5 8's 40. Now you should subtract. 40 minus 40, 0. This is our remainder. And this is our quotient. Did you understand where the mistake happens? You should not do that mistake.